the free balloon which began man's conquest of the air still plays its part, even in this ultra-modern war. At Moffett Field, California, the gas bag without power is used to train crews for dirigible balloons of the Coastal Patrol, the blimps, and the gas bag in the shadow of the blimp. Handfuls of sand affect the level as they drift across the countryside. That road is the landing place. To release gas, pull the ripcord, and down she comes. The handling of free balloons, which are so sensitive to weight and wind, is the best of training for lighter-than-air men. Let out the gas, and the fabric deflates. There's nothing more graceful than the free balloon, which recalls the romance of the early dawn of aeronautics. Football fields in the Pacific Northwest are anchor bases for balloon barrages operated by the Western Defense Command. At headquarters, whereabouts of each balloon is plotted on a map of the zones to be protected. Generally, strategic areas where munitions plants and military points are located. Then orders are phoned to the various commanders in the field and up they go. The Northwest takes a page from London's book on the balloon barrage, and the Army keeps them flying. 